after tonight and horrific crash that killed a woman who was driving. Witnesses say it was no accident and possibly a case of road rage. Simon Shaykat on Detroit's east side with more on what that driver is accused of doing that could lead to criminal charges. Detroit police are describing a tragic crash that unfolded here on the city's east side. And even more disturbing, they say there is the potential that this was done deliberately. It was here along Nevada, south of Packard, that police say witnesses could see the driver of a red Dodge Ram pickup purposely sideswipe a black Ford. Just after 2.30 p.m., people living here say the woman inside the Ford was forced to lose control, striking a nearby pole. This witness is still in disbelief. Oh, man, that's pretty bad. I was at the store, and I know all the lights went out in the store, so I, I knew something was going on. Witness Charles Mayfield says things got even worse from there. The 59-year-old woman in the Ford got trapped by the pole that came crashing down onto her vehicle as flames engulfed it. The victim, unable to get out, died as a result of what happened. That's pretty ridiculous. You know, we all need to slow it down. You know, we got the holiday now, so, you know, that's pretty rough. Police say the suspect lost control of his own vehicle and also crashed in the area, but survived. He's currently at a nearby hospital, his condition not being released. Police say he could face criminal charges if it's determined the crash was caused intentionally. So far, the victim's name and the name of the surviving driver are not being released. Detroit police also want to hear from anyone who may have witnessed how this crash unfolded. If you have any additional information, please contact them right away. From Detroit's east side, Simon Shaykat, 7 Action News.